Hi, I am Deputy Krista West. And I'm Deputy Caitlin Reed. Uh, we are animal control officers for Borgard Pair Sheriff's Office right here in Jorita, Louisiana. We have a combined seven years of experience in this field. And in our experience, we have seen an increase of dogs and cats in more than the years we've passed. In my three years of being in this position, it's been my goal, Caitlin's goal, to never have to euthanize for space. Um, we've only euthanized sick, injured, or highly aggressive animals. And now more than ever, we're being faced to make decisions that we have fought so hard not to have to make. Uh, shelters across the United States of America are overcrowded, and our destination shelters that pull our dogs are now full of the very dogs they have pulled from the south, causing a roadblock for our animals. We have 19 kennels in our facility, and our kennels are doubled just to make room so we don't have to be forced to euthanize. But unfortunately, you can only put so many animals inside of a kennel for it to be humane. Um, now more than ever, we're needing an outsource for our dogs, and we have none. Shelters are full, transports are down, puppies are coming in. We have three pending uh, litters that have 10 puppies in each litter. Um, the amount of owner surrenders that are coming in are defying all the numbers in the past. Um, now more than ever, we need help. Mental deterioration of animals inside of kennels is a real thing. Uh, dogs will shut down after being inside of a a kennel for so long despite our efforts to enrich them, uh, play with them. Unfortunately, a home is always better than a kennel. So if you can help in any way, please reach out to your local agencies to offer to help them in any way you can by fostering, adopting if you can adopt, um, fostering for a short time, and always stay and your animals. Uh, this is the reason why we're in this position now is because of the unwanted mm -hmm. overbreeding. Adopt, don't shop. Don't shop. Be a part of the solution, not the problem.